big screen. Spe- <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry. The sorry. Me. So, no, hi, thanks, hi. so Speaker Johnson's voting record shows that he is strongly opposed to gun safety legislation. Even when Democrats controlled Congress, they could not pass the universal background checks or the assault weapons ban. So what realistically can get done with the Speaker? How can a deal around the Speaker? It, look, I hear the question. I mean, look what just happened last night. Look what happened. In Maine, in a small community, I think about 30,000 people, uh, and clearly, uh, you know, the gunman is still at large. Um, and so it's a dynamic situation on the ground. But as far as we know, 18 people were killed. And we should not have weapons on, of war in, in our communities, in our schools, and anywhere in our communities. And this is an epidemic. This is a gun violence epidemic. And the time is now to act. And here's the thing, Speaker, Speaker uh, Johnson and all of the members on the Hill, Republicans in, in Congress, they have the ability to stop this. They have the ability to put forth legislation to deal with this issue. They can change this. They can help save lives. And we're just not going to take, uh, you know, it's great to hear thoughts and prayers. We obviously want to give the, the families who, who are dealing uh, with this tragedy and the victims who are clearly dealing with this tragedy, obviously we want them uh, to make sure that they know that they're in our thoughts and prayers. But that's not enough. That's not enough. And so we were able to do a bipartisan uh, piece of legislation to deal with uh, gun violence, a, a piece of legislation, obviously that's law that we hadn't seen in 30 years. So there's ways to get there. There's ways to get there. But executive actions is not enough. We got to do more. And just because, um, you know, it may be difficult, it may be hard, doesn't mean that we stop. Doesn't mean that we stop uh, fighting, and that doesn't mean that the president is going to stop saying over and over again that we have to stop this gun violence is epidemic. There, is there other executive action that the president plans I don't to have, sign? I don't have anything uh, to read out at this time. We don't have anything to read out at this time. As you know, there is a office of to prevent gun violence, which is a historic office, uh, which uh, which the president is very proud of. That's being led, as I said at the top, by the uh, by the vice president, uh, who's part of that. Um, you know, leading the efforts of that office. Uh, but look, we have to continue to do the work. We have to continue to do the work. And that has to be done legislatively. We can't just continue to do executive actions. As you know, the president has done more than two dozen of them, signed, uh, signed two dozen of them. But we need to do more. We need to sign uh, legislation into law. We need to build on the bipartisan action that, that was taken last year.